One, two, three, not it. Well, well then. A duck opinion. Zombies! Might as well just go back to the start and just do them all how we did them. I know it's kind of repeat the process. That's why I was thinking maybe... I know we have to do some generators for the perks, but to be honest, like, you should m maybe just skip on doing certain generators. I mean, because you have to go back and do them eventually anyway, unless you really feel you're going to pack a punch really quick, you know? I mean, I've pack a punch for round 10 before, but... Shit, you got to do it quick, and I like spending my money on other stuff. I have a feeling this guy might die when I go in here. I hope he doesn't. So you have to open this door to get back here. It's only 500. There's only one door that I haven't opened, and it's the one between here and the other spot. So we're going to come here and put this down. You can place these down as long as you have the music player and a disc. Whatever disc you have, you can place down in the right spot and open this portal. But to get the crystal for the Pacific one, it has to be in the Pacific area. It'll only drop one crystal each time you go inside Pacific 1. So I knew I was probably going to lose that zombie. So a tip, build this before you get the crystal because of the fact that it takes a long time to build. All right, so I have everything I need to build the staff, but I knew that zombie would die. I was kind of, I was just testing it. I knew he was probably going to die. So I want to get out of here as soon as possible. Grab your musical device. Get the hell out of here. Quickly, um, I can't go back uh, the other way. I didn't. I don't want to pay for it. So we're gonna go this way, and we're gonna run. We're gonna run so far away. No one armed. I refuse to surrender. All right, now I can worry about getting this. Uh, I can worry about getting the power on later. I want to worry about staying alive, and getting to my run spot, and then we'll go get the power on and pack a bunch of do all that stuff in the next round. And then pretty much from there, we're going to beast mode until round 20. So if you've been a little bored at me just running around with this huge map, I apologize. But I promise, let's get through this round here. We'll go pack a punch this STG. And um, we'll get a staff, our fire staff that we just put together. I'm not even worried about the other staffs. I'm not trying to use them, so I'm not worried about them. I could make them, though. We have tips and tricks for that. Links in the description below or in the Black Ops 2 Origin playlist. So we're going to start doing some circle strategies. A mental note to self, too. I want to go get stamina up again. I, I, hadn't, I didn't get it since I went down that one time. So I wanted to be my last perk, too. I don't want to forget because you can't have more than four perks unless you win one as a reward. So you want to think that through when you're getting your perks. I could really use that times, too. I'm just going to let these guys live. And then run it, run about and get that times two. That's just gonna butter for the rest of the game. I swear that times two is just what we need. All right, I'm gonna head this way. It'd just be easier for me to like shoot the whole horde in this direction. A whole horde right there. And also, it'll fill up this soul box. Maybe I'm not really trying to fill up all the souls, though. I honestly don't care about the. Uh, the gloves you get, you get like these power gloves that I really don't care too much about, to be honest. Woo! You have to watch out on those filler spots. They will get you killed. None's come behind me, right? Don't come behind me. You gotta watch those filler spots. They get you killed. Like those spots that have little tiny bridges. Woo! Howtodie.com. Seriously. Okay, I know it's not the last one. They're gonna start spawning again. So I wanna start getting these generators turned back on so we can pack a punch get this staff in my mouth <laughs> we can also maybe pack a bunch of different guns the box is over here I told you we'd probably have to eventually come back here that's why maybe we shouldn't have came here to begin with and it's awesome I have one zombie okay two zombies ten more show up okay three zombies four zombies five zombies I'm dead oh yeah we have three we have three so be careful around three zombies, but let's hit this box. I do not understand this need. For I wouldn't mind a ray gun or something. All right, we're just gonna take whatever it gives me and just get something good, and then we're gonna get the staff and we're gonna get out of here. But um, this is a really good circle spot. I mean, even at high rounds, as long as you have the jug, it's a pretty cool spot. So I like that gun. We'll go with that gun. 
I'll hit the box one more time just to see what it gives me, but I like this gun. The M19 is sick, man. It's all Mob of the Dead. It's great. And with the staff, an M19 upgraded? I haven't even seen it upgraded on here. Uh, I would have liked monkeys, but it's okay. We'll go ahead and leave. We have tons of money. We'll keep these three zombies that we can totally outrun. Shitty shotgun. I don't even know why I dig those up. It's just for some reason so addicted, addictive to dig those up. It's so weird. So don't forget to get generator two, which is right here, so we can actually pack a punch. We need all the generators lit. We cannot allow them to take and I have also, I've, I've spent the points I needed for the challenge. So I can actually get another perk, but I don't want to get another perk until I get stamina up, which we'll get here in a second. But the bad thing about that is you can get another perk, and you can have five perks. You can even have six from what I've seen, but um, the thing about it is if you get a perk that you already have, then you won't be able to take it. So it's kind of lame sometimes. But let's go ahead and let's get our stuff. Like, for real. We've been going on and on for these last ten minutes, running up and down this map. Let's get what we deserve. I want this pack punch. I want a pack punch right now, and I want my staff in my hand. We're gonna build that bad boy right after this pack punch. So here's where pack punch is. Once you get all these lit, pack punch shows up here, gets all sparkly and shiny, and uh, I get me a new shiny gun. Oh yeah, the sparky easy. Look at that cool camo. It pretty much just puts blue on all the camos. So like I said, if you get that white disc in the music player, put it here. This opens up. And I know I have more than one zombies, and I know I haven't shot him yet. That's a beautiful max ammo that I'm not going to need, but... But yeah, if you get that, it opens up this bottom panel down here. And so you want to get the music player when it's done. It doesn't close or anything, you just don't want to forget your player. And this is where we come down, and we're going to build our epicness. It's actually pretty deep down here, deeper than you think it might be. So this is where we're going to build it after we get all the pieces. The fire staff. We're going to grab it. And I, I totally just traded my packet punched my packet punch mob of the dead gun that I only fired twice. Great. <laughs> uh, you guys didn't see that. I'd much rather packet punch this than MP40. That's not true either. Oh, f my life, you guys. I'm not doing too well right now. Oh well. Let's just go. That was sad. You guys can laugh at me in the comments. Good duck. You're a noob. You're such a noob. You totally accidentally traded your pack of punch gun for that staff. I got too excited. I was like, yes, I got my staff. But that was that was bad. So I'm gonna take these guys out now. I'm going to grab my gun, and we're gonna go back to Jug and run a whole bunch of rounds. We might go get our prizes after we get stamina up, but we need to save some money now that I wasted a crap load of money. <laughs> Oh man, it's late you guys, what do you expect? Man, I've been playing this map all all day since it came out. It's been pretty awesome. Very awesome map, but it's pretty late you guys. So, excuse my dumbfoundness on trading in that gun. I feel like a little noob now, but again, mistakes will happen. You will go down sometimes. You will lose weapons sometimes. It's part of the game, so just be careful. Be careful, know how to get back from your mistakes. Make sure, you know, if you have something there to fall back on. As you see, the big mech punks here. It's kind of weak because it comes on seven, and then it comes five rounds after that. But I got something for his ass now. I didn't even notice he was here. That's one thing I hate about him. You're like, derp, I didn't know you're here, but I want you to meet my staff. Got him. Oh, actually, he just froze for a second, I guess. Now, I mean, the thing I hate about the guy is he's really hard to kill. Like, you have to hit him in like his little spot. I got him that time. But you like have to or it's not gonna happen. So I'm just gonna burn the rest of these guys because there's ammo here times two so I might as well just burn them. Go the next round some good ammo. But like I said I'm just gonna barge through these next rounds until like probably around 15 or so. I'm gonna go get, go get stamina up eventually and gonna go get the uh, perk and maybe pack a bunch of another gun but at this point I mean you can go to round 20. There's nothing else you need to really do. I mean, for me, I need to get another perk, but if you guys played it a bit safer than I did and you didn't go down, you have all your perks already. You have some great Pack-a-Punch weapons. You have the staff of your choice, whatever staff you want, you can get within this time limit. So, it's just up to you how you want to play. Gotta watch out, the warbots are coming. You see how this dude cock blocked me? You gotta watch out coming through that path. Oh shit, I done wasted that time too, didn't I? 
I don't waste it most of that times too. I'm just like dirt. Oh well, we have we have plenty enough money to get stamina up. That's mainly what I'm after. At this point, I don't even know how to tell you guys. <laughs> At this point, we got this. I mean, yeah, we could definitely die, but from here on out, I could just circle here the whole time. I don't even want to show you guys a different circle spot because this is my legit circle spot. <laughs> I made a circle strategy for this spot. I haven't made any other ones yet, but we'll work on it. There are different circle strategies. This is just mine. It's just my spot. 